Yeah. That is the woodshed. Sun's going down. It's time to go to work. Sun is going down and time so to the go to work. The sun is going down. So I, I have to go to work. You have to go to work. Try to get something done before it's dark out. What are we going to do? We're what gonna, are you going to do? We're going to go do some electric fence repair. Electric fencing repair. Yeah. Electric. We got to get our fence up before the cows start having calves. Of course, it's shaking. <laughs> it's because bumpy there. Yeah. if the calves have their calf, their cows have their calf in the bush, we can't take care of it, and problems happen. Cow might die. The calf might get killed by coyotes. And the coyote would have a banquet. Oh. The coyote would kill the calf. Uh oh. So if that's why the fence need to be with electric. Yeah, we want to keep the cows where we can see them. What is this here? A shop? Uh, yeah. These are their shops in here. Everything for uh, needs, I want to get a needs to the farm. Everything is in here. Like I'm inside the. My son is there. I'll show you the shop here. A shop, everything you need to repair. Something around here. The shop is a shop. Hey, Mom, yeah? you might want to go in the truck. Where? Dad's leaving you. Okay, I have to go now here. This is the, the show in the shop. Okay. I have to go. In how? So where are we going now? We're still around the farm. <laughs> Before going fencing, we need to collect all we need that for electric fencing. While driving here around the farm, there is two cows closer to me. Side here. Hi. Tomorrow they are gonna do cow sorting, cattle sorting for, uh, for they will sort a, uh, a good one cow and a yearling for selling. My husband and my son is BC preparing for everything. That wire is strong. Hi, how are you? Yeah, I'm okay. You okay? Good. Are you on come here? I fell on my back. Oh yeah, I heard that, but we can delete that. <laughs> okay, fine. We can delete this. Yeah, I don't think you I don't think it was rolling. I slipped on the ice. Yeah. We need salt and sand. Yeah. There's fat fat farmers here. It's good that it's still icy. Okay, we're pulling a long he wire. He fall on the ice bank. We're pulling a long wire here, okay? You're pulling along the wiring? I'm pulling a long wire. Wire. What? Keep going. Keep yeah, going, he said. I don't want to break a post or something. There's a bit of a load on that. Yell if you want me to stop. I want to dip here. What a beautiful sunny. What time is it? 4.32 p.m. here.
It's beautiful sunny here. Saturday. We are busy. My husband and my son is uh, going for electric fencing. Fixing electric fencing. So that the cow is preparing for the for the clothes for the near uh, calving. Calving means it's a month where the pregnant cows are having giving birth to the calves. Calves is a, uh, they call calves means uh, a baby calf, a calf, a calf. A baby cow is called a calf. Yeah, and so calving means uh, getting ready for birth of a pregnant cow. Before I didn't understand what's all those words, but now I'm beginning still learning around those uh, happening when you have a cattle ranch. It's really interesting. I always be thankful to the Lord. Uh, the reason why we sent here in this place because at my age in our my hometown in the Philippines where I was born I haven't seen this beautiful surrounding here it's beautiful it's all made by God it's Every, stinky right here it's stinky all poop <laughs> around here <laughs> I will show you the poop around here uh, it's frozen. It's not it's, as bad as it looks. Yeah, it's frozen now because, yeah, there's still snow around here. Uh, what is Lucky's waiting there, Daddy? I don't know. Does he look okay? I don't know. But the wire will get tangled in his feet or something. Yeah, he's coming now. He's uh, going to ride that. Uh. It's stinky here. Smells cow poop and cow around. So this truck, GMC truck, is really good for this kind of bumpy GMC um, GMC truck. What did I say? GM? Jim C. <laughs> yeah, sometimes my English is like I feel like I want to make it short. Then <laughs> I haven't. I haven't. I, we should try and think of an acronym for GMC uh, abbreviation. God makes what? GM. GM. G God M makes. Uh, C. C. Uh, chromosomes. <laughs> it's bumpy here. The snow is beginning to melt. Yeah, the truck is four-wheel drive yeah. and also low range. Low so range. we're in four-wheel drive, low range right now. Because every poop is like a speed bump here, okay? <laughs> it's stinky. If you are here with us, you smell the stinky poop. But I like it. It's refreshing. <laughs> How come the poop, poop uh, cow yeah. is refreshing smell? Ah, uh, whatever. Look at this drying. What is this tree, Daddy? This is also spruce. Giant potholes where the cows been sleeping here. It's called melt hole. See, it's melting. Some of the area has no snow anymore, but those are poop. The cow poop. It's bumpy. It's like we are on uh, bumpy road. He's coming. No, yeah, but the wire. Is the wire still being pulled? Stinky here. That, that one is poop. Cow poop. Ooh, closer. That is poop. Hard poop. I'll show you the cow closer. That is... That... That... That is cow poop. A real... Frozen... Freezing cow poop. Poop. See the surrounding here, guys. This is. Are we on the north or south of the farm, Daddy? Well, we're north of the yard. We're north of the yard. Yeah. Bumpy! Beauty of surrounding.
There are some cows there too. You know, they love to eat, non-stop eating. There are some cows there eating. Still eating. At this time, 4.38 in the afternoon. And I'll show you my son. He's driving the... Uh, he's driving the... Coming back in the truck. I wouldn't. If you're stuck, it's just work getting it out. I have to adjust it's too close. Where are we going now? Going to the side. Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! Oh. It's bumpy, guys. <laughs> hey, you see the wire on the ground here? The wire here? It's right here. Just We're looking over. for the wire. It's fine. It's lucky wearing safety gloves. Thank you. Closing the window of the car because it's quite frozen. It's, it's, it's cold. Guys are in action. In action of fixing a wire. Be careful of that, Lucky. Yeah. Those are wire. We have safety glass, that's good. Look at Lucky's safety glass. That's made in the Philippines. I bought it when we had our vacation there. Nice, it's for summer. Safety glass, and uh, it's two and one. Safety glass, and then sand glass as well. I think on the other side, it's just kind of twisted. Like it's not close together. Okay. So. so this is wire. If you can see this, this is wire. Someone and just hold this. So it doesn't someone hold this. Go back. Do we need extra wire at that end? I guess it'll pull tight, right? Yeah. So that is fixing the wire here. And then after they fix it here, they will turn on the electric. Well, I don't know if it's all going to happen today. Well, not today maybe, but... There could be cows already back there, but... May not be today, but that is what they are doing here. They fix first all the wire and they're going to turn on the... Without power, I don't want to put the wire up. Yeah. So, power's not connected. Um, I wonder if we should run the second wire right now. Yeah, maybe we should. Why not? Um, There's stinky poop everywhere. I could smell the poop. You need water? I have water here. Lucky, you want water? Thank you. How about you, Daddy? What? Water. No. You're missing the. Oh. 
사태인데. 와, 진짜 고마워. 아, 안녕하세요. Calving season means uh, preparing for the pregnant uh, cow to give birth to their baby. And uh, the baby cow is called calf. That's, I, I, have, I just learned it when, I was, when I'm here in Canada. But before, I don't really understand what is calf, when it, what is calving means, you know. But um, I'm still learning, and I'd like to still learning and learning and learning everything around here. I really appreciate why the Lord sent us here. This is a big, such a blessing to be part of this uh, property here or area. Well, I don't own the property. It's my, you know, my, my, my father-in-law owns it. And it's a family farm business. My brother-in-law and my, my husband. And uh, my son is, uh, is just helping also, but... Anyway, I am grateful that uh, the Lord sent us here. Such a blessing to have a wonderful place. Everything is all made by our Creator, who is our God. But I am very thankful for Him. Always feel uh, crying whenever the Lord sent us the beauty of the surrounding here. The trees are all made by God, the Lord, our God, our Creator. And all these cows here, calves here, are all made by the Lord. Hallelujah thankful for God, grateful for the Lord, grateful, grateful always for God. I have nothing anymore to be asked for. What can I ask for but to say thank you Lord for everything. So this is me. I'm small, a small little girl. Nene, Nene means a small girl in the Philippines. Actually my, my name is a native name which is uh, from Bicol province, which is my father's hometown in Bicol. Yeah, fences are important. Yeah. Cow's got 50 acres of bush and, and pasture back there. If they have the calves back there, it's trouble. We lost one two or three years ago. The younger cow had her calf. I think left it. Sort of forgot where it was or didn't take care of it, didn't stay with it, and she, we found her with another cow that calved uh, 300 meters away toward, towards home, and she thought that other cow's calf was hers, but it wasn't, and we had two cows with only one calf. Well, the other calf was dead in the bush somewhere. Mm -hmm. that's so the that's reason. not good. Yeah, that's the reason. We had a cow calved in the bush back there, couldn't deliver. By the time we found her, she was she couldn't get up. We put her in a loader, took her into the barn. She died that night, hypothermia. Oh, wow. Hypothermia? The vet told us... Hypothermia. Or the government vet told us that, that she was calving. So she was calving so long, she died from hypothermia and, and whatever. We call it... Uh, I forget now. The uh, inability to deliver a calf. There's a special word for it. Okay. Leave him lucky. Let's go. So my my son there is helping to dig, helping to dig and dig. Hey, what's that on your side? Oh, there's a flyer and there's a hammer there. <laughs> That's really a hard working guy. And uh, yeah, my son. Maybe if I hammer them down, it will break the ice under me. I wonder if there's another plastic clip underneath there that's holding it from coming up. Maybe. You get a lucky Hope you like my videos. 
Thank you for watching guys. Bye.